When times are tough, it's all about being better and more efficient. And when it comes to equipment, that might mean customizing and upgrading the equipment you already own. And that's what our friends at Precision Planting are all about. We have a product called Smart Firmer. It's a heat and seed firmer that has some electronics that allows us to do that sensing technology we just talked about. One of the things it can do is measure how much moisture we have in the trench. And we all know that it's so critical when we plant seed, seed needs to be placed in moisture. So now we're actually sensing that moisture in the furrow, and we can actually determine if we are at the planting depth we're planting in moisture. Secondly, one of the other things we can monitor is residue in the trench. Um, some growers like, like myself, we're growing corn after corn. It's pretty uh, critical that we get last year's corn residue out of the furrow. Smart Firmer has the ability to sense leftover residue from last year's crop in the trench. If we find that happening, we can go to our residue managers up front, make the adjustments, and try to wipe that residue, keep that, res that furrow clean. So that's going to be some yield uh, detriment if we have that residue in the trench. It's an air pocket and it can wick moisture away from the seed. One of the new things Smart Firmware will do for us this year in 2019 is it can actually measure cation exchange capacity. So that's the ability of a soil to hold nutrients. So now we can actually measure that on the fly as we're planting, and that's critical because now we can start developing spatial management zones, knowing where different levels of CEC are in the field, and then we can act accordingly, whether it's variable rate seeding or variable rate fertility. Organic matter is another thing we can sense with, with Smart Firmware. The ability of a soil to hold water. I look at this as drought potential. Um, if, if a soil has low organic matter, um, it's going to have low water holding uh, capabilities. And so if we have that, in order to feed the crop, we need to keep it raining. If the rain shut off, we're going to have some drought soils. But we're measuring this spatially now, and we know where areas of high organic matter are and low organic matter. It's the sensing technology that we're talking about at Precision Planting. As we plant, knowing what's happening in the furrow, knowing the changes in the field, and all reporting it back into the cab of the tractor so we can react and take control. So one of the, the products we're beta testing this year in 2019 is a product called Smart Depth. And this is where we're removing the T-handle where a grower would normally change his depth on the planter. We're removing that T-handle and we're putting an electric motor here so we can, with the press of a button, move this planting depth uh, deeper or shallower depending on the conditions. Now, we can do this in a manual situation, knowing what furrow moisture is, and then pressing a button and moving this up and down, or our hopes are to go automatic. So as that 30% moisture that we talked about just a moment ago changes in the soil profile, Smart Firmer will sense it and then relay that information to Smart Depth and we'll change planting depth to make sure we're in that adequate amount of furrow moisture automatically all the way through the field. So this will be a beta test for 2019, but it's gonna change the way farmers are planting because we're understanding where our planting depth is in relationship to moisture. And that has been a very difficult challenge in the past. The only way growers can get that information is to stop the planter, go out, get on their hands and knees, and dig that seed out. What we're introducing as a beta product this year in 2019 is a product called Furrow Force, and Furrow Force is going to be a way for us to close the trench. And what is a closing system designed to do? I mean, no matter what the planter brand or how many rows we have on a planter, we're all creating a furrow, a trench out in the field that we ultimately plant seed at the bottom of the trench. But the closing system is designed to come in and blow the compaction out that was caused when we made the furrow. And furrow force is interesting because now what we're doing is we've got a two-stage system. The first stage system has, has sensing ability, so it knows how much force that we need to lift and fracture and collapse the furrow that we created with our opening. The second stage then is designed to remove the air pocket, stitch that trench together, and that, in our opinion, is a, is a really agronomically sound way to close the furrow. The real trick with this is changing conditions. In the past, with closing systems, we set up for one condition, and as it changes, we don't have the power to change it. Now we've got the sensing ability, we've got an airbag here where we can control air, we can put more oomph on this when we get into tougher, tighter soils, we can close better, but when we get into mellower soils, soft soils, we can take pressure off this bag and bring this system up to get the proper closing done for us. But we're sensing on the fly, knowing the conditions, reacting, taking control with the closing system. One, one of the ways farmers can experience the precision plant products is by coming to the Precision Technology Institute. It's a 200 acre on-farm research learning center in Pontiac, Illinois. We're just south of Chicago, about 80 miles. 
north of Bloomington, uh, Illinois, right along Interstate 55. But at our Pontiac PTI farm, we've got 200 acres of on-farm research where we're challenging the status quo, just trying to, to find ways that are more profitable. We can get higher yield or make more dollars on a, on a per acre basis. We also have all of our equipment on display. We have what we affectionately call our sandbox area, where we have tractors and planters available for growers to climb in that tractor, turn the key, and actually go plant corn and experience the technology. We take them out in the field and show them what they can do agronomically, but then a grower can actually get in and go plant corn in June, July, August, even September to really understand what this technology can do for them and compare it to the current technology that they have on their farm today. All they need to do to register to come to our PTI farm is contact a, a, their local precision planning premier dealer and they can get them all signed up and come see us this summer.